Excuse me. Have we got a show for you? Broccoli, celery, gotta be. kids, and welcome to Veggie Tales. I'm Bob the Tomato. And I'm Larry the Cucumber. And we're here to answer your questions. That's right. Now, b before we start this, this day's lesson, Larry has to tell you a story about the time he thought his, his bunny slippers were monsters. Ooh, I remember once I thought they were monsters in my closet. Well, it turned out that they weren't really monsters at all. Just my fluffy bunny slippers. That doesn't apply to today, either. Lucy Anderson already got at her lesson a, lesson a long time back when we taught her about uh, when Junior got a little scared. So now, let's read you to the letter, Bob. Now, today we got a letter from Alice Johnson from Baton Rouge, Louisiana, who writes, Dear Bob and Larry, Sometimes people bully me, and I really do not like that. It. They apologize, but I don't think I should forgive them or not. Could you help me decide whether I should or not? That's a good, good question, Alice. Should you forgive them? I know how you could decide. Before you decide, you gotta watch the story about Kai vs. Kane and how he forgave someone who did something really bad to him. Enjoy. Bob. Have you seen my friends? Uh, not now. Ah, what a good day. Uh. What happened to the lights? Uh, I don't think this is scary. Where, where is everybody? Okay, this is starting to get scary. Hello? It was me. Who said that? It's me, King Pig, and I turned off the lights in the house because they wanted to prank you all. Oh, you will pay for this. I'm not going to be forgiving you for a long time, if not ever. That was the best prank ever. I got to pull more pranks like that. Don't think I'm done with you. Oh, crap. The chase is on. Run! Ouch! I'm not 
cleaning that up! Ugh. I'm... Ugh. Why guy versus Kane? It was a prank! Oh, it was a prank! Oh, sorry, I didn't hear you. I was distracted because you made me mad. I'm sorry. It's okay. I forgive you. But I have a question. Why do I need to forgive anyway? You see, when someone apologizes to you for something and they're sorry for it, and you don't forgive them, God gets a bit upset with you. You have to forgive anybody 490 times for God to be really happy with you. Now do you get it? Oh, that's why we need to forgive. Well then, King Pig, I forgive you. Good, please help me now. Don't worry, I'll take you to the hospital. Thank you. Well... I hate to break the fourth wall, but before I do, I say my work is done, but I still, I hate to break the fourth wall, but why was I here of all people? Well, it's because no one else really had the time to act in this, so yeah. On to some silly songs with Larry. And now it's time for Silly Songs with Larry, the part of the show where Larry comes out and sings a silly song. Boom, boom. Ladies and gentlemen, we invite you to relax. Let us pull up a chair. As Larry the Cucumber presents... The Baby Kangaroo Song. Everybody's got a baby kangaroo Yours is big but mine is blue First one's small then what about you all? Oh, everybody's got a baby kangaroo Ooh. I cooked my kangaroo delicious stew Got his head stuck in a shoe Spilled some peanuts and got the flu oh, Wait a minute, wait a minute Stop right this instant What do you think you're doing, Alvin? Uh, singing the first Goofy song? No, you're not. You're being too goofy. You can't just say anyone's got a baby kangaroo. Everyone does not have a baby kangaroo. We're going to get nasty comments and nasty letters saying, I don't have a baby kangaroo. Where is my baby kangaroo? And are you so prepared to deal with that? I, I, uh... I don't think so. So stop being so goofy. Can we just end this song already? This has been Goofy Silence with Alvin. Till we next time to hear Albert sing. Everybody's got a water buffalo. Yours is fast, but mine is slow. Albert! Okay, okay. Well, we're over here by QWERTY the computer to talk about what we've learned today. And so what we have learned. Bob, you destroyed the radio! Oh. Oops. Congress can't learn something today. And that is that you need to forgive people. Otherwise, God might get a, a bit upset with you, but he'll always forgive you. And other people won't forgive you back if you do something to them. Um, anyway, hey, that's it and for today's episode of Cartoon Tales. If you enjoyed this episode, consider watching the next. And remember, God loves you and he made you special. Goodbye. Goodbye.